Hello friends, welcome to E for Engineer channel. Today we will be discussing how to write incident matrix of this RLC network. With the incident matrix at our hand, the KCL becomes A into I equal to 0 and KVL becomes A transpose into V becomes E. Here I is unknown currents vector. This V is node voltages vector. And this E is branch voltages vector. So let's dive into writing this uh, incident matrix. The size of this incident matrix it is given as n minus 1 by B. This n is number of nodes in the circuit. So here if we see this is node 1, node 2, node 3 and node 0. For writing this incident matrix we consider only the 1, 2 and 3 nodes. We won't consider this 0th node as because this is reference node we are considering. Okay. If we consider this 0th node in the incident matrix then it is called as augmented incident matrix. So let us write this uh, incident matrix. For this uh, we have told like n minus 1 nodes by B. This is the size of this uh, incident matrix. The, what are the branches in this uh, circuit? We have 8 branches. This is branch 1 that is here this is denoted as 1 and this is 2, this is 3 and so on 4, 5, 6, 7 and finally we have 8. So the branches we have are 1 till 8. Okay, let's now write it. This first row in this incident matrix will correspond to node 1. And second row to node 2. Third row to node 3. Okay. Here we will denote the branches. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and then 8. How we will write? We will see. If we consider this branch 1 current, this is entering into node 1 voltage. So, in this node 1, this branch current, it is entering node 1. Whatever the entering currents we have, we denote it with minus 1. And this node 2 and node 3 has no relevance with this branch current. So, we give it as 0. And we can just write here node 0 for your understanding. We will just write here that node 0 for your understanding just to uh, get an idea. But uh, you know right if this node 0 throw is there we call it as augmented incident matrix. Okay. Usually we won't write this last row which is the reference node row here in this incident matrix. If at all we write we call it as augmented incident matrix. Okay. So first, uh, first for your understanding here we are taking this branch 1 current this current it is entering into node 1 so we have given minus 1 corresponding to node 1 row okay uh, it is leaving which node node 0 we give as plus 1 here and then we will see this branch current 2 it is leaving first node as it is leaving we give 1 here and it is entering 0th node. So, we give minus 1 here and then these two rows or these two voltages or node voltages I mean has no relevance to this particular branch. Okay. And then this third branch current. Okay. This is leaving which node? First node. So, we are writing 1 here and entering 0th node. So likewise, we write till this 8th branch. Okay. So, this is our augmented incident matrix. Now, what is incident matrix? It is nothing but the augmented incident matrix without this node 0 or reference node. So, the incident matrix will become A is equal to minus 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0. This is how we write the incident matrix of a particular network. Please find this problem and the solution which I have explained in our website eforengineer.com. The link is given in the video description. Thank you for watching. For more content like this, please subscribe to eforengineer.